What's up, YouTube? This is James coming back at you with another informative video. Um, I tell you, it's like I told y'all before. Uh, this summer is going to be, I, I mean, I predict, I just believe this, you know, um, a very bad summer for uh, European people when it comes down to animal attacks. I'll tell you that right now. Now, let me see. Just what, last week, I did a video about some dumb idiot chose to go and get inside of uh, the ocean off the coast of Africa where he almost got swallowed up by a whale. Turns out the whale spit his ass out. He was blessed. Uh, the other video I did about the lady who took her dumb ass and got inside of an enclosure at the zoo in Arizona, I think it was, with the black jaguar who started chiseling on her and chewing on, on her ass. She thought she was going to take a selfie with him. Oh, yeah, by the way, do you know that that idiot turned around and said, told the zoo that they should move the barrier back, you know, further. Then that way people won't be, you know, uh, encouraged to cross the barrier or whatever. <laughs> to me, if they had a moved it 10 miles back, that dumbass woman still would have got inside that barrier to, to get that selfie. You know, but the Jaguar made sure she forgot all about her selfie. I bet she even lost, <laughs> probably left her phone in there. Then you had the one, what was it? The lady who had the bull. Yeah, the one that was fed up with her shit. And he just scraped and scuffed her ass up. And then she had the police shooting. You know what I'm saying? She was trying to tell him what to do. Bull wasn't having it. You know, shit like that. I mean, it's just going on and on. And now, it's a lady, European lady, brutally attacked by vicious dogs. It says, Good Samaritan video captures brutal dog attack on Arkansas Road. Wait till y'all see the black heroine that saves the woman. Just wait. Check this video out have video of the attack in their possession after we posted it on our Facebook page. They're now using it to help track down the dog's owner. WRG's Jessica Gertler got a copy of the video and we warn you some of the images you're about to see are pretty gruesome. We put this video in slow motion so you can see the horrific scene Misha Bryant witnessed last Friday afternoon on St. Francis County Road 323. As I got closer, I see video with a to believe there's a woman under that pack of vicious dogs. Bryant says she honked her horn, hollered, tried everything to scare off the dogs. Once I started something, that's when some of them bagged back. So that's when I got out the car and I was just like, go, go, go. The woman had bites all over her body. Her mother shared these images to show you just how gruesome this attack was. It just looked awful. Her leg, her arm, her face. Her clothes was ripped off, off of her. But I think the, the challenge is to determine uh, which dogs, you know, did this. St. Francis County Judge Gary Hughes told us deputies know about Bryant's video. He says if they can track down the dogs, the owners will face a citation for letting vicious dogs run astray and a fine up to $500. St. Francis County has no animal control. So, no, we would not uh, confiscate the dogs. He said if the owner gets a citation, a judge will determine the animal's fate at a hearing. The dog remains in the owner's custody until then. Do you feel like this county ordinance, it has enough teeth? Uh, I think, um, you know, we're certainly open to looking at uh, um, some new regulations maybe that we need to put in place. <laughs> If Bright hadn't have stopped Friday, there's no telling what would have happened. I wouldn't want that to happen to me, my child, you know, anybody. And there's no certainty this won't happen again. In St. Francis County, Jessica Gertler, WREG, News Channel 3. Just a horrible scene. Judge Hughes says the dog's owners could also be in violation of a state law that would require them to pay for all medical costs. If and when the owners are found and held accountable, we will let you know. Now, I know y'all seen that shit right there. <laughs> Ooh, we. I'm telling you, you know, they talking about some what would have happened if Misha Bryant hadn't showed up. 
I can tell you, do you really need to even ask that question? You know, common sense tells you what I, I can tell you. The woman would have, she would have been eaten alive. You see, you see how she was laying face down in the dirt like that, in the mud and everything. Those dogs didn't give a damn about eating her ass up. The thing is, is this, you know, it seems like they are awfully, awfully lax about, you know, their um, ordinances about dogs running loose. Because, see, the thing is, is this, I don't care what kind of dog you got. If you think it's sorry and all that kind of shit ain't won't bite hot butter or whatever. You know what I'm saying? The thing is, is this. That dog gets around a pack, another pack of dogs. They get this pack mentality and they will eat somebody ass up as you saw in this video. That's just the way it is, you know. But uh, I wonder if that lady who was eat, being eaten up like that, you know, was she racist? <laughs> And I wonder, will she still be racist now that she found out that a black woman saved her life? You understand what I mean? See, because you know, in those rural areas right there, oh man, you know how they do. You know what they about. You know, a lot of them, nigger fly out, they nigger flies out, they shit mouth so fast, shit just like spit. So I'm just wondering... If she's racist, if she's racist, will she still be, you know? But wow, did y'all see that, that that black woman? She was amazing. I mean, she got out her car uh, and stomped, you know? And it was a blessing that the Most High sent her to help that woman. It was a blessing that the Most High let her voice be heard to that pack of dogs. Because if they didn't, if he, if it wasn't, if he wasn't in the cards, I'm going to tell you right there, right now, that woman ass would have been through. That's just all there is to it. Y'all tell me what y'all think about this situation here. Um, oh, yeah, you know, it says, too, before I go, deputies in Arkansas hope new video footage can help them track down the dogs and their owners. <laughs> what kind of, I mean, y'all, all we seen was the dogs on the woman eating her, basically. That's all we know. We, we know about it. What kind of video footage are you going to do? I mean, unless they follow them back to the house or whatever. You know what I mean? I mean, these people are just awfully lax about. It seemed like they're not really that concerned about those dogs eating that woman ass up like she was like they were, you know. But y'all tell me what y'all think about this situation. Uh, I'm interested to hear y'all thoughts, you know, uh, like, comment, share and subscribe. And this is James and I'm out. Peace.